What's going on, y'all? It's Claude. You're checking me out again at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? So, before we get started, I'm wearing a hat primarily because it's raining. Plus, enough said. All I'm going to say is this. When I'm stepping out in the rain, I got to make sure I'm going to actually go get something as far as food that's going to actually be worth my time because I'm going out in the bad weather. Connecticut Magazine for 2022 actually just put out a list as far as all the best restaurants, establishments, bodegas and stuff and you name it. <laughs> all jokes aside, they actually put together the best restaurants to eat in Bridgeport, Connecticut. So who but me, this guy right here, to kind of give you the real deal, the scoop, the skinny, the what it is as far as where you can actually touch down in our fair city of Bridgeport, Connecticut and get some of the best food possible. This next video is actually going to be me swinging over to a place that I've seen it never really experienced before. So I'm going to step in for the first time, find out what's going on with Brewport, one of our local breweries in the area, and find out if they got some good snacks, some good eating for us. Plus, plus, I'm going to do something on camera that I've never done before. And this video is not going to be for children primarily. It's for the adults. I'm really talking to you guys this time around. I'm actually going to have an alcoholic beverage on camera. Yeah, I'm hearing that the fabled Michelisi's Italian Ice Sangria. Think about that for a second. Watermelon Michelisi's Italian Ice Sangria is where it's at. On top of it, I want to try and find out if they actually have some really good pizza. I'm hearing their flatbread pizza is to die for. So we're going to find out. Does Brewport Brewing Company, Bridgeport, Connecticut, have what I need to warm me up on this cold, rainy day? We're going to find out. Very real review time. Y'all ready? Let's get started. Mostly healthy food reviews.
have it, ladies and gentlemen. I just left Brewport Brewing Company, Bridgeport, Connecticut. As usual, I'm gonna drop the address in the bottom of this video. Where do I begin? Where do I begin? First of all, I had the Michelisi's Italian ice. I thought I was gonna get served the watermelon scoop, but I got served the cherry scoop. And truthfully, it was just like I remember as far as a kid having Michelisi's Italian ices. If you've never had an Italian ice from Michelisi's, you're missing out. You need to actually see if you can find one and you need to get yourself and get your life together on all oh, those were good. That sangria was very, very flavorful, very fruity. The bartender threw it together really nicely for me. And I'm not really a big fan of sangria. And as you see, this is the first time I've actually had a drink, an alcoholic beverage on camera, because I know that a lot of kids are watching the videos and stuff. So again, this video is not for the children, not totally, because I don't condone underage drinking by any means. I'm a dad first and everything else second. So you get the point. I would definitely get the drink again. You see the price point on it. It cost me about $11 for the drink. However, for my adults, the drink itself is about market values, which you're gonna pay for one of those specialty items. So $11 for a drink, it's not overpriced. It is what it is. Secondly, and this is the star of the show. I actually had their tree hugger pizza. Tree hugger, healthy veggies. You see where I'm going with this one. Flatbread pizza, and I got the hiccups. That's how good this pizza is. And I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna devour it when I get home. But honestly, this was good. We had mushrooms, peppers and onions. We had broccoli, tons of very, very fresh broccoli. And of course, garlic, tons and tons of garlic. Oh, that was a good pizza. It was simple, it was to the point. It was straight like that. I would definitely get it again. And for $17 on a small, if you guys know what a real pizza is gonna cost and consist of, you guys know that $17 is not that far-fetched. If you're getting quality in this tree hugger, I would definitely get it again. I would definitely recommend it. Brewport, I had no idea. Now I know, and to be honest with you, they're right down the street from Seaside Park. And actually the biggest city of Connecticut is Bridgeport, believe it or not. And honestly, Seaside Park is our biggest city, 375 acres, and Brewport is right down the street. It's right next to the amphitheater down here and people are out here doing it. Love Bridgeport. I love what it's turning into. And I love the fact that people are actually coming out here supporting our city. I'm a Bridgeport representer, what more can I say? In either case, ladies and gentlemen, if you like the videos, do me a favor, click subscribe, turn notification on. It helps channels to grow. It helps my channel grow. I'm almost at 5,000 subscribers so far. Yeah, yeah. That's what's up. I want to thank everybody who actually has been subscribing, who's been rocking with me, who's been following me. I appreciate you guys. And this is actually another video dropping, showcasing the city of Bridgeport. And this is showing all the different foods that we have in different establishments and all the different flavors we got going on out here. This is called at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Newsbreak. I'm on all social media platforms. If there's a health bonus in my food, it's an added bonus. And yes, I did have a Michelinese's Italian ice because I said I was going to try one one day. Today's that day for me. And it did get me a little warmed up. So I'm good, but I'm not buzzed or anything. So I'm able to drive home safely. That's what it is. Driving safely. Don't drink and drive, guys. All jokes aside, definitely not a good look. Please, please, please. If you decide to drink at any point, drink responsibly. In either case, let me get up out of here. Y'all be cool on the other side of the pillow. Let me take off. I'll talk to you next time.